Eight months ago, Ethiopia elected a new president. That president is Dr. Mulato Tashoma, who also served as Ethiopia's ambassador in Beijing, China. I'm here at the National Palace of the country to speak to him for the first time about his experience as a student in Peking University and as a diplomat in Beijing as well. Dr. Mulato Tashoma is Ethiopia's fifth president. He is also one of the most senior politicians of the country. President Mulatu served his nation as ambassador in Japan, China and Turkey, among other countries. He is also one of the architects of the intact present-day China-Ethiopia, China-Africa friendship and collaboration. Let's just begin with uh, your first impression about China, Mr. President. Mm, I know China when it was um, not that developed, not that open, um, not that impressive, to say so. It was not that, um, that clear where China was heading to. It was through time that uh, we came to know China is undertaking a special revolution, a very interesting revolution. That's the economic revolution, emancipation of the Chinese people from backwardness, uh, from agrarian economy to industrial economy. Your enrollment in, in Peking University, how do you really remember it? How, what was really the experience in that particular university, Mr. President? We are a group of Ethiopians who won the scholarship. And um, I was supposed to study hydraulics engineering. But uh, Ethiopia of uh, the 1970s was, uh, it was after the Ethiopian revolution. And uh, some government officials uh, were visiting China and uh, Ethiopian students were uh, also invited to attend a reception or a sort of that at the embassy, Ethiopian embassy in Beijing. And uh, the high officials uh, asked what we are intending to study, though I was at the language uh, institute, Beijing language institute during that time. I said I'm going to study hydraulic engineering. And the others also told their uh, uh, future field of studies. And I was strongly uh, recommended to change my uh, field of study into uh, social sciences. The future president, the future diplomat, um, Dr. Mulatu, how was he stay in that particular uh, university collaborating with Chinese students, international students, and your general success there and perhaps some of the challenges you face? When it comes to my relationship with Chinese students, I preferred to have uh, a dorm mate with Chinese that helps um, in uh, learning the language, knowing the culture, and to really uh, show your friendship and, uh, and uh, uh, also uh, to help each other in our study.